welcome to my channel. My name is Giselle and we do makeup here. We do makeup, we do fashion, we do hair. So if you are into any of those things, you gotta make sure that you subscribe so that you're in on all of the fun. Today we're going to be doing this super fun look right here. It was extremely easy and, well, at least I think it was easy. Um, I think you're going to enjoy it. And if you would like to see how I created it, well, then make sure to keep on watching. So I'm gonna do my eyes. I'm gonna go in with the Perception palette from Makeup Shayla and ColourPop. And I'm going to use Revenge, which is this darker orange, red, whatever this is right here. And I'm going to put this all over my crease. And I'm using a 217 from MAC. And I'm just going to keep blending this because this is a very pigmented color. And I'm just going like, I haven't added any more product. I'm just going on the outer edges of this and making sure that it's blended and there are no harsh lines. And I keep adding the color until I'm satisfied with the intensity because it takes a little while for you to blend everything in, get rid of those harsh edges, and by the time you're done doing that, you lose some of the color. So I go back in and reinforce it a little bit more. I don't like to add a ton of color and then have to work with that to blend it out. Um, I like to add it little by little. And I also don't like it when my eyeshadow is all the way up too close to my brows, so. Next, I'm gonna go in with my Pop Cosmetics eyeshadow palette. And what is this one called? Blink Brilliance. And do they have names? They do not have names. So I'm gonna go in with this mauve color right here and I'm going to put this all over my lid. I'm going to use a flat eyeshadow brush this one is from IBY. And this is like a reddish color, but it has a hint of pink, if that makes sense. And then I'm gonna go in with the shimmery glitter one that's right above the other color we just used. And I'm going to use a flat brush. I don't know how well this is gonna work with a brush. Let's see, I'm gonna press it on, not well at all. <laughs> that did not work. So I'm going to dab a little bit of lash glue on my lid first. With my finger. Can also use the NYX Glitter Adhesive, but I don't feel like getting up to get it. So this will have to do. And then with my finger, I'm going to press on the glitter. There we go. Oh, it's gorgeous. Oh my God. This glitter is beautiful. Wow. I am in shock right now. So pretty. I don't even know if it's showing up on camera the way that I'm seeing right now. I'm keeping this look simple. I really just wanted to try out this um, Pop Beauty glitter and I am so in love with it. But we're gonna keep going. I'm gonna put some mascara on and some lashes and I'll be right back. Okay, so I have my lashes on. Now we're gonna go to the bottom part and I'm going to add, that's my brush. I'm gonna add that pink color, pinkish reddish color that I did on the top. I should have started with that Makeup Shayla color. 
to follow the same pattern. So I'm gonna do some now. Because this is not intense enough on the bottom for me. I want to intensify the bottom a little bit more, so I'm gonna go in with shade from the Perception palette. And I'm going to use a 212 for MAC, because this goes really nicely right under the lashes. Now I'm gonna grab a little bit of Played Out, which is a dark brown from the same palette. It just doesn't have any shimmer on it. Hit the like button if you make ugly faces when you put it on mascara and eyeliner, because I sure know that I do. This is a gorgeous vampy color, oh my goodness. Okay. Now I'm going to go in with mascara, my favorite Big Shot mascara from Maybelline. And I'm going to add that to my bottom lashes. I need to go get a new one. I added a little bit of setting powder under my eyes because I had to clean it up because I had some slight fall off. But I'm going to move on to my lips and then I'm going to add a little bit more blush because the blush I have on now is fun, but it's a little too pinky. I want a little bit more color. Um, I'm, 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 I'm thinking of going in with this. Mm, yeah, that's gonna be pretty. So I'm gonna do this lipstick from Kiss Me um, by Life Glam, and then a High Fine Shine from Urban Decay in Shadow Heart. So hopefully this looks okay. If not, then we'll do a different lip. I've talked about Life Glam before on my channel. I'm going to leave a card right here if you want to go check them out. Um, they might not have this color because it's a monthly subscription, but it's worth a try. This is so pretty. Now I'm like, do I want to add gloss to it or not? Hmm. I'm going to add gloss to the center and I'll see how I'm feeling. I like it better matte. You know what? Let's add the gloss, whatever. I didn't know where I was going with this at first, but it's a fall tutorial. Now for the inner corner of my eyes, I'm gonna go in with the Af Afrik, Afrique. Girl, I don't know how to pronounce that. 
by Juvia's Place. And I'm going to go in with Angelique. I'm going to pop that right in my inner corner. The thing that I don't like about wearing gloss is that I feel self-conscious that like I'm going to get stuff on my teeth and I keep sucking my teeth to make sure there's nothing there. So forgive me. And I'm just going to get my brush a little bit wet. And I'm going to go into this, the Fenty Beauty Highlighter. What is it called again? Oh, this the Diamond Bomb and, and how many carrots. And I'm going to pop that in the inner corner just to add a little more glitter. Then I'm gonna add a little bit of Love Joy from MAC because I need a little bit more on my cheek. And I'm actually going to add a little bit of raisin too. Why not? It's dab, dab, dab. finish off I'm gonna go in with my all nighter spray and that's that Ooh, let me fix my hair a little bit yeah. okay everyone here is the completed look I am absolutely loving the way that it turned out I love the glitter I love this dark lip it's giving me life and this highlight is popping right now. Like it's super popping. And when I started the video, I already had my face done and I was doing a review for the new Fenty highlighter, which you saw me using in my inner corner a little bit. And it's the Diamond Bomb in How Many Carrots. And it's this right here and that's what I have on. And to get it to look a little bit more wet, I use the brush wet. Not super wet, I just spritz it a little bit and I put some on because I felt like the glitter was like a little too grainy, if that makes sense. And with it wet, it would like just make it look a little bit more wet. Duh, if that makes sense. You know what I'm talking about. But I really hope that you enjoyed this tutorial. As you know, like I started my YouTube for makeup. I love makeup. I do makeup on other people. I'm a makeup artist and it's literally my passion. So I would hope that you guys are enjoying when I bring makeup tutorials to the channel. I know that the beauty industry here is super saturated in terms of YouTube, but I just love it. I love playing with makeup. So I'm going to keep bringing tutorials and reviews for you guys on that. I say this every time, but if you have not done so yet, please make sure and subscribe. Thumbs up so that YouTube knows that you enjoy my videos and so that I know as well. You know what I mean? Like, let's grow the channel. I'm trying to get to 10,000. Fingers crossed. I don't know if I can make it by the end of the year, but I would love to make it to 10,000 by the end of the year. That would be amazing. Again, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you on the next video. Bye.